Hi, we're focusing on decimals, and this is Taoping AI's math industry. This is a decimal, that's a percent, that also relates to a decimal, and that's a fraction, one-fourth. All equal the exact same thing. You see these numbers in your everyday lives, like mostly percentages and decimals, not much as fractions. But you see these in your everyday lives, like... Mr. Krabs is going to give us a briefing about what he wants us to do to advertise the Krusty Krab. According to my research, a full 2% has never set foot in the Krusty Krab. That's 2% of money that's not in me pocket. And when I think about that 2%, we get so mad. When I see that 2%, I think of pie. I'm not talking about pie! These bull ducks are probably spending their money at some other restaurants. We need to find that 2% and reel them in. I need you two boys to get out there and promote the Krusty Krab! Will we get overtime pay? Over what? Who? Oh, sure thing, Miss Krabs. I'll get right on that. No. Yes, SpongeBob was right. You do see percentages in pie charts. Like, this is a pie chart. Like, for example, we have seven subscribers who are teachers, and the rest, which is 35, which are students. So basically, seven of 35 is equal to 20%. So basically, 20%, which is about here, if you divide this into 100, because this is going to be 15, right here, 20 is going to be about here, 20% of the, my subscribers in our channel are teachers, and the rest, which is basically 80%, are basically students and other friends. But when Mr. Krabs says 2%, that means 98% of his customers have been to the Krusty Krab. The population of his city, only 2% have never set foot on the Krusty Krab. And yeah, this is a pie chart. So basically, if he drew a pie chart, which you saw in the video, there would be a really small slice of that 2%. Now, to make the video easier, Move on to video number two. Thank you.